This video will show you how to remove the camshaft phasers and oil control valves on Pentastar V6 engines. We'll start by reminding you that the magnetic timing wheels must not come into contact with magnets. Start by removing all ignition coils and spark plugs from the engine. Remove the upper intake manifold and cylinder head cover from the side of the engine you will be servicing. Now mount the dial indicator set to the appropriate cylinder head and position the probe at either cylinder number 1 or 4 spark plug hole. Next, rotate the crankshaft until cylinder number 1 or 4 is at top dead center on the exhaust stroke. Set the dial indicator to 0. Verify all the timing marks are properly aligned. Note that the left and right side timing marks are not the same. Use a paint pen to mark both sides of the timing chain to the corresponding timing marks on the intake and exhaust camshaft sprockets. Install the applicable camshaft phaser lock against the cylinder head cover mounting surface with the tool number facing up. Remember, it may be necessary to rock the camshaft slightly, a few degrees, with a wrench when installing the camshaft phaser lock. Loosen but do not remove the intake and exhaust oil control valves on the side of the engine you are servicing. If servicing the left side, remove the timing chain lock from the left side of the engine. Now, using pin 10200-3, lift the pawl off the rack. While holding the pawl off the rack, push the timing chain holder into place between the cylinder head and the cam chain guide to force the rack and piston back into the tensioner body. The holder remains in place while the phasers are removed. If servicing the right side, remove the timing chain lock from the right side of the engine. Now, use the timing chain to compress the tensioner by slightly rotating the exhaust camshaft clockwise. Insert the timing chain holder into place between the cylinder head boss and the tensioner arm to hold the tensioner in the compressed position. The timing chain holder remains in place while the phasers are removed. Remove the exhaust oil control valve and pull the exhaust cam phaser off of the camshaft. Finish by removing the intake oil control valve and then pull the intake cam phaser off the camshaft.